Hi friends, so I am going to talk to you about if you are charging your car, your Kia Karen's Clavis EV or any other EV from a public charger just like static, right? So or there are other options also like uh, GOBP, uh, then Tata Power, then there, there are so many other ch uh, charging stations. I, I chose static as a you know place where i could charge so so i'll give you a demo of the static app uh, so this one i used for planning my trip and as you can see in the screen right i can see whatever charges are available in the nearby location but anyway i mean we'll have to plan a trip right so i click on trip and then i give my source to be bangalore uh, and let, let me type in Hyderabad as my location where I want to go. Say for example, I want to take this trip, right? So now it shows uh, all the chargers in the map that are available. So you can click any of them and add it to your trip. So for example, I have chosen a static charger here, right? And and added it to the trip i i will add one more say near hyderabad somewhere i will charge again say i choose that also and add it to the trip again just like i did here so now my trip is set right uh, and i can start my trip right um so if we start the trip Right, so it will come to the map particularly and I can now start the Google map and start driving and it will take uh, where do I stop where exactly is the location of the charger and all it will set it up for me so I can just add it in and uh, uh, you know connect it to the car um, and then so I now chose the charger chargers that I selected right and I can see the charger details, what are the different connectors here. I can see, you know, any reviews on those, on those chargers. Right. So similarly, I'll show you once more. So this is the charger, right? And like these are the available chargers there. So you can select any of them and start connect to your car when you are there and uh, start the charger from here itself the only thing is you will need to make sure that you have adequate balance in your wallet so you can add the credits like this and then proceed for the trip i hope that this information is you will find useful so please uh, uh, send a like to this channel i will really appreciate that moving on there are details on how much it takes to charge uh, for a particular tip i'll talk about how much it took uh, for me to charge in the static charger please do subscribe to this channel uh, uh, the people who are following my channel possibly would know that this was a bangalore to kabini trip in which i took a halt in mysore and i charged my car there so you can see the car is getting charged in the static charger so this video is all about you know what was the cost associated to the uh, charging right that uh, i was charged for static so just to uh, give you a brief and you can also check my other video where i have uh, actually given you know the range of the car and uh, described in detail what you what kind of range can you get with this car uh, so this is the kia karen's clavis ev top model which is the uh, htx plus extended range version that uh, i am going i am charging right now so uh, in this video particularly i will be talking more about you know what are our charging options was it easy right so my experience was like uh, i had to plan up front uh, i took uh, a couple of apps that i downloaded right uh, so the useful ones are uh, 
like static uh, then uh, you have plug share right so i think plug share has, gives you a lot of uh, you know charge char charging options lot of you know options where you can charge so you could uh, do a trip plan uh, in 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 these apps right uh, in static as well as plug share and there are other apps also you can particularly do um, some sort of um, trip planning where you can also choose where, where exactly you will like to charge so uh, for me in my trip i uh, chose this location uh, you know uh, you can filter based on the ratings right um, uh, whether people were able to charge on that charging point or not whether there was any power problems etc so uh, so based on those rankings which i got from plug share where you have a way to filter right uh, and get the most excellent uh, charger right so this was the charger that we got which was in a mall uh, in mysore right um, so um, so in the end of the video i have uh, you know the screen uh, where i have discussed about you know how exactly the it was looking like so uh, as far as the charging goes both uh, while i was going and while i came back i charged at the same point right and the total distance that i covered in the entire uh, trip was around 476 uh, uh, kilometers uh, right so uh, the range that i got um, on this trip uh, was 406 kilometers for a hundred percent battery charge so uh, i had given two halts um, right just to charge um so uh, you know you so whether you get uh, range anxiety in this car so i won't say that you don't because uh, you know you would always want to make sure that you have proper charging uh, before you go somewhere where there are no many not many options left right for example for us right we were going in a jungle um, so we didn't have many um, charging options when we were in jungle right uh, any nearest charging station would be uh, 60 kilometers from there right so we had to charge in mysore and then it then it was pretty fine we did not know how much how much uh, so this was the uh, you know back trip where i'm charging again Right, in Mysore in the same place so yeah I charged twice while from Bangalore to Mysore from 100 kilo 100 percent it dropped to 65 uh, percent right and then uh, from there I charged to 95 percent in in this mall and uh, in the static charger and then I went to Kabini came back by that time it was 55 percent and I charged to again 95% and I returned back, right? Um, uh, and uh, the, the charge that was left uh, was 55% when I, I came back to Bangalore. So this was what the trip was like. Um, so yeah, now is the time for me to show you how, what was the expense. So is my static wallet and these are all the numbers that you can see uh, right so i recharge me 1000 and i spend all the 1000 in these two charging uh, stops that i made so in the first stop um, right uh, so it was 315 rupees around um, 19 uh, 19 rupees per unit was the cost uh, while while you know i was charging from here so for so uh you know so i charged uh using static from zero to uh 70 percent i would say not even 100 percent 70 percent right because i charged twice once 40 percent and another time 30 percent so total 70 percent so 70 per for 70 percent charge i spent around uh 1000 rupees so you can see all the bills that i have 